I am Irene Sands. I'm a digital meteorologist at WFTV Channel 9 in Orlando, Florida. A digital meteorologist, uh, one of the few in the country at a local level, and it's, it's, it's a blessing. It's taken off, it continues to take off, and um, the digital world for weather, it's very important. As we know, weather does not happen between a newscast or right at 6 and 11. Um, it's a 24-hour job, and now with the digital world, it's just allowing us to keep the public informed. We don't have to wait until the newscast comes on or until I arrive to work to, to maybe do a cut-in or anything like that. So it's, I see it as a blessing. I know it turns to be a 24-7 job, but I think that's your passion as a meteorologist and your dedication. It has to be 24-7 because ultimately the public safety is the most important part of it. As a digital meteorologist, I take care of the website, my station's website, the app, all the social platforms, and I also do weather forecast on digital and graphics, weather producing. I also do my own climate section on the website, and it's great because the digital world allows you to expand on topics that maybe you can't on TV because you're, you're restricted to, to time, you're restricted to certain policies, you're restricted to, to maybe just being hyper-local. Or if you're at a national level, you get 30 seconds. So it's different limitations. So with the digital position, I feel like I've been able to expand a little bit more. So when I graduated, the Certified Broadcast Meteorologist program or certificate was, was already in place. Um, I didn't have to grandfather, I, I, was, I went into the, the CBM. What I tell all the early career professionals, take the test, study a little bit, take the test, get that feeling of what it is. You'd be surprised that you know a lot of it, and most people pass. I mean, it's not, it's not as scary as it sounds, and very important today jobs are requiring the CBM to get hired. I'll tell you, that was one of the things that got me hired in my current position. They were not hiring anybody that did not have a CBM. 